Hello, this is Crote, and it's another beautiful day to play Subnautica. Uh, today we are going to build some stuff. Uh, first of all, from what we found in that underwater base yesterday, the water filtration machine, only two titanium. We're definitely going to get that. But first, we're going to need to add a couple rooms to the old base here. And actually, we might... Yeah, I bet we're going to have to move this stuff, because that's going to be where our... I'm going to expand out this direction. So, I'm going to get this stuff taken down, and then I'll bring you back when we start building. Okay, we're back, and we need a multi-purpose room, which hopefully will... Ah, there we go. Another one over here. Come on, go in the right place. Wait, that's not the right place. There we go. Inside for before I drown. Well, my new processor arrived, and I tried to install it last night, but apparently, <laughs> uh, I gotta update my BIOS first, and that's gonna take a while since I don't have a floppy drive. And but I'm gonna work on that tomorrow. And hopefully we can get that all cleared up. Okay, let's put our... Uh, where's it at? Put this stuff back in here. Actually, I'm gonna... I don't want to get it up all, all up in this plant, so I'm gonna go... Put that there. We'll put the communications relay right here. And then the battery charger. Yeah, we'll put it back down here. Give me all your titaniums. Okay, do we got any batteries that need help? Nope. But actually, well, I'll stick them over here. We certainly don't need to carry all these around. Okay. So, in this one, this is our, yeah, we, ah, let's put our water machine here. What? Oh, it attached it to a wall. I don't remember that. Oh, yeah, I guess it does. I thought it was a center thing, though. That's cool. Actually, we can put it over here. Um, well, can't put it there, I don't think. Nope, nope. Okay, let's see here. I guess we will put it in here. I 
And what this thing's going to do is it's going to pull, I guess, automatically pull water from the ocean and separate the salt and give us, yeah, it'll give us bottles of water and salt, which is pretty awesome. Okay, now the next thing we want to make, uh, let's see. Here we go. Four titanium ingots, lubricant times four, advanced wiring kit, moon pool. Yeah, we gotta make this. So, I am gonna start getting materials together and I'll bring you back when we're ready to build it. And if, uh, while gathering materials, anything cool happens, I'll bring you back for that too. Board captain.
Okay, we're back, and we have, we just got some lubricant. Let's pull out our titanium ingots and our advanced wiring kit. And where did my, <laughs> next time I get all this stuff out of here. Did I put my builder tool away? Yes, I did. Oh, you know what, while I'm here. I want to get rid of these freaking signals. I keep turning them off, but they keep turning back on every time I log in. So let's dump those in here. For now. And oh, you know what? I could have I could have left that window in there. Oh well. Okay, moon pool. Make sure we got everything. Yes, it connected. Nice. Alright, let's get the old Seamoth here. Now we can stop parking out front. Welcome aboard, Captain. Technological advancements right there, buddy. station thing. Oh, here it is. Glass, two computer chips, holy crap, two titanium. Yeah, let's go work on that. I can do that. Caution. Blood nutrient levels decreasing. Calorie intake recommended. Food. 
Vital signs stabilizing. here Seamoth modules common modules torpedoes prawn suit modules Let's see what we can make here solar charger nah, I don't care about that perimeter defense that would be nice polyaniline I have no idea where to get that magnetite and a computer chip poly man we gotta we're gonna have to go shopping. Okay. Ooh, I could use another pressure compensator. Another computer chip. Jeez. Hole reinforcement. Oh, that wouldn't be a bad idea. Power efficiency. And storage. We already have a storage module. Torpedoes. Vortex torpedo only two titanium. Yeah. I have to make some of those. Gas torpedo, gas pod, titanium. Uh, that's that. We got to pick up those uh, fart bubbles from the fart fish guy. On suit thermal reactor. Jump jet upgrade. Yeah, we got to make the prawn suit one of these days too. Oh, now we can name our sea moth. I, th I think I have an idea. Uh, let's... Wait, what do we got here? We got... Can't even tell what that says. Name. Stripe 1, Stripe 2. Oh, interior. This must be the exterior. So let's roll this up here. Oh, nice. Red. That is a very red back on the Seamoth. Interior. Let's make it, uh, make it black. Stripe one, we want something a little brighter. Oh, nice, green. And stripe two. Red back. <laughs> because uh, uh, one of our commenters, Red back, has been having some trouble with uh, our with some YouTube ad problems. Although you know what, I'm sorry, Red back, but I think this is a girl. <laughs> oh wait, no, maybe the sea moth doesn't have a doesn't have a voice. So you got lucky there. Alright. Oh, I wonder if the beacons change the name. Yeah, Seamoth Redback. Oh, and it is, we have the red icon already, so that's cool. So let's get back and see what it says. Oh, it doesn't actually say it on there. Yeah, I guess they don't, except for the beacons. Well, let's get in red back and go look around for some 
We're gonna need some copper. And what else was it? Uh, well, I know we need copper, so... Oh, you know what? I think there's copper around here. been through here once and got a bunch of stuff. I don't know if it respawned or not. Stay over there, shark. Wreck, probably. Yeah, I'm not seeing mud. No way, can we get inside there at all? thing. Let's go get our repair tool.
Now, I know I have a, a moon pool, <laughs> but since the repair tool is right next to this door, I'm going to go here for now. Welcome aboard, Captain. take this. Actually, I'm going to take a flare, too. I never used a flare. Okay, we want to get rid of these. What do we got? Titanium, lead, salt, copper. like something. Man, our girl gets around, don't she? One more thing to check. Let's see if uh, that little tunnel goes somewhere. Oh, it does. Nice. Yay, a maze of places to get stuck. I don't think there's anything new here for 
move back. Well, I'll tell you that flare is a good idea for tunnels. <laughs> it really lights up the whole area. Okay. We didn't even die. Say no to crack, kids, but let's go in this crack. Nice copper. We'll take it. Man, mouse. Learning in the mouse is still a challenge. Couple copper, that's good. Yeah, we should, yeah, we should look at these coral tubes. There's usually something in there. Nice. Jackpot, maybe. Lead, titanium, copper, titanium. Fishy. Not that we need water anymore. Instead of the back. Copper, nice. Nice. Four more.
head back. Not sure this episode was quite as exciting as some of the others, but uh, we're gonna probably, well, let's see what I can make first. Welcome aboard, Captain. Lots of copper, nice. Pressure compensator, pull reinforcement. I remember what we wanted to make, and it wasn't in here. It was the rebreather. Wiring kit, fiber mesh. Two silver. And fiber mesh. I'm going to guess we got to go get creep vine stuff again. Creep vine sample two. Unless I have some. Oh, fiber mesh. go deeper without running out of oxygen so fast. Alright, let's put our big mask away. Hopefully radiation, since we repaired the Aurora, then we won't need that helmet. Man, we're hungry again. Sweet. 
Okay, that'll hold us over. Also, we do want to get another pressure compensator for going down there, because we were right on the edge. And that will require plasteel ingot computer chip. Great. Well, we do got lots of copper now, so it shouldn't be that bad. Plasteel ingot is a titanium ingot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And I believe a piece of lithium. chip which is a copper wire which is two copper piece of gold and two table coral in the modules. Huh? Crushed up now 300 meters. Nice. Alright, so the red back is set to go deep. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Red back's gonna go deep. Alright. And what? Was I going to put something over here? I can't remember. Maybe later. Oh, we got more water. Nice. We will hang on to that. And I think that's going to be it for today. We uh, made the moon pool. We made the vehicle modification station. We got the pressure compensator. Got the rebreather. Uh, I think next time we will head back down to that underwater base and see if we can get, I mean, see what else is down there. I mean, there might be, uh, the alien containment unit would be nice, uh, but we can probably finish off the, um, oh, what's it called? Let's take a look. Modification station, definitely. Nuclear reactor, I'm not really excited about that one. I definitely want to finish, get the stasis rifle. Because that, oh man. The stasis rifle is the... <laughs> you can actually go kill a Reaper Leviathan if you got one of those. Which we might have to test out one of these days. <laughs> but that'll be it for today, folks. Uh, thanks for visiting... Uh, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't. Feel free to share the video with anyone you think might enjoy it. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.